It's often said that folks that suffer with ADHD also struggle with object permanence, but that's not exactly right. It's a bit of an unfortunate colloquialism over what object permanence actually is. So object permanence is the knowledge that the object still exists when it's out of sight or it's been hidden or whatever. So we're, folks with ADHD do struggle remembering about that object. It's not the same as object permanence, though. It's it's just out of sight, out of mind. It's a different thing. We don't actually think this thing stops existing, you know? Uh, I, I mean, it's like it doesn't exist anymore, but it's not the same thing. People with ADHD have memory issues, and this includes maintaining active representations of things that are out of our line of sight. We don't forget they exist, we just forget about them. Um, bills don't stop existing, they're just not on our mind, so we forget to pay them if we don't have that visual reminder. Your medication doesn't stop existing, it's just been moved, so your visual reminder to take it is gone. And this is in part why someone with ADHD is more likely to have a home interpreted as cluttered, but it's usually a form of organized chaos. Um, all the papers on the table, um, objects on the sides, piles of clothes, etc. Uh, it's kind of how we, we function. Sometimes these are referred to as doom piles. Uh, it can be really hard when you live with someone that doesn't operate in the same way. Um, they might want everything away, and it means that there might be this constant battle of you forgetting to do things uh, that you've intended to do, or that even that they've asked you to do. Um, but, you know, <laughs> in fact, just whilst recording this now, I've remembered a, a hospital bill that I'm still due to pay. Um, and it was probably due about three or four months ago. So I do apologize to the hospital right now that I, I owe that um, um, fee to. <laughs> um, obviously, that's an auditory reminder um, of hearing myself speak and talking about bills. And there you go. But what's the chances of me leaving here, heading into the house to find that bill, and whilst looking for it, if I get that far, forgetting what I'm doing? Again, because this bill has been put away, I won't remember. But just remember, this is not object permanence. It is just out of sight, out of mind.